Following Prince's death in April of 2016, Sinead O'Connor was interviewed by phone by the Carver County Sheriff's Department. She had known him for years and was asked about the iconic performer and his lifestyle. Now, the recording has been released via TMZ. On it, she claims he commonly used hard drugs. Everyone is mistaken who believes he did not have a drug habit there, entirety, of his life, she says on the recording. He used hard drugs commonly. I know this because I spent time with the man. In the interview, Sinead also alleges Prince was abusive with women while taking certain substances. When he would come out of the room he would be very violent, very aggressive. His eyeballs would disappear, literally, from his eyes. They vanished, and he had been very violent and these women will be coming forward over time. He had been extremely violent to a number of women in his life, including myself. Several women were put in hospital while Prince was under the effects of these medications. He tried to beat the SHT out of me. I had to escape out of his house in the middle of the night, the 51-year-old singer added. I managed to escape. He had me locked in the house, ready to beat the SHT out of me because he'd gone upstairs and taken some weird drug. When he came back down he was very violent and the eyeballs are disappearing and I'm scared SH-less. This was not a very nice man. I always joked that they didn't call him Prince for nothing. The Irish singer also shared a bizarre story behind why Prince didn't want to release his famous Black Album. The reason he didn't, he told me himself was that he had been taking so many dark drugs that he had had a vision from God and God had told him the album was evil and he was not to release it, okay.